this is a Blake's Seacock and uh, I'm just showing you how to remove the cone by undoing the screws and there's a locking nut just underneath as you can see where I've got the spanner and as you can see there's one either side and you can see the collar is coming and of course if this uh, sea, uh, seacock was seized solid we would probably go outside of the boat and use a metal bar to bash underneath to hit underneath the inside of the cone which would then release it if it was badly pitted we would use um, a grinding paste and work it in backwards and forwards inside the cone until it was nice and smooth and then re-grease it and then just do the reverse and put the screws back tighten it up as you can see and the, and lock it with the nuts underneath so we tighten it so it is fairly tight then slacken it off slightly so we've got a nice smooth run not too slack but nice and smooth also on the modern Blake Seacocks you see they've got a grease nipple on the side and if this is done at least once a year um, you only need to grease this up and work the, uh, the cone backwards and forwards to work the new grease in so it does save a bit of time and effort but occasionally we do have to take them apart